telephone's ringing. I know. Aren't you going to answer it then? No. It's still ringing. Then you answer it. It's not for me. And it's not for me. Then it must be ringing for someone else. Exactly, that's why I'm not answering. But there's no one else here. Right again. That's why I'm not answering it. <laughs> it may be someone wanting something. What could they be wanting? They may want to know if we're in. Well, of course we're in. I'm here and you're there. Isn't that right? We're here. Yes, I know that, but they don't. And you think I'm going to get up to tell them that? Naughty, naughty little Willy. That's a good baby. If we don't answer it, they'll think we're out. Absurd, isn't it? We couldn't be more in. Pass the cream, Ronald. <laughs> I wish it would stop ringing. I think I'll answer it just to tell them we're not out. Silly. If you answer it, they'll know that anyway, won't they? Yes, I suppose you're right. Ah, still. I could tell them there's no one else here that's out. And if you don't answer it, they'll know that as well, won't they? Anyway, just to find out who wanted to know. The telephone stopped ringing now, dear. Yes, I can hear that. You mean you can't hear it? Well, that's that. That's what? That's what happens when people telephone just to find out if a person's in or out. Serves them right. If we're in, 
we're in. And if we're out, it's a wasted call. You're a logical woman, Elsie. Pass the cream, will you, Elsie? I can't pass the cream, but I'll pass you the jug. Oh, it's empty! <laughs> I know that. I finished it. That's why I passed you the jug. Well, what's the good of a jug without cream? None at all. But better a jug without cream than no cream without a jug. I think I'd rather not have no cream with no jug than have no cream with a jug. Well, you can't have everything, Ronnie. ignore it this time, shall we? For you, for you. 